I'm Angie Anglestein and today I'm going to be digging deep into the real reasons for deforestation. Side note, some people in the past have died after digging too deep into the government's plans, so if I die shortly after this gets out, you'll know why. Now, most people think, well they're just cutting down trees to build more houses and buildings. But some other people think they're destroying lives. The government is getting rid of all our oxygen so we can't survive. And as a matter of fact, the second thought is half right. The real reason for deforestation is to kill off children so the government saves money on schooling. Children are taking up too much oxygen when they're running around huffing and puffing. And let's be honest, children are annoying. Wait, get, get off! Annoying. Get off! This passes the ball! Studies show that children's lungs are smaller, so they are affected by the deforestation much faster than adults. It also affects elders, but that doesn't matter because they're going to die soon anyway. <laughs> in 1960, there were 1 billion children below the age of 15 in the world, and that was 35% of the population. Now there are 1.9 million children, but they are about 27% of the world population. In 2050, it is estimated that there will still be 1.9 billion children in the world, but they will only be 20% of the world population. Does this prove that deforestation to kill off children has been happening for a while now? Where's all the air? Oh, An average human breathes about 740 kilos of oxygen per year, which is roughly 7 or 8 trees worth. Imagine how many trees we would need to cut down to kill off all children. If we're killing off children, that means we won't have a future, because children are our future. Maybe the government has figured out immortality and they want to live on forever. But either way, it all links back to deforestation. Let me know what you think. Are children really so annoying that the government wants them all dead? Or do you think I'm making this up? But remember, if I suddenly die, you know why.